First shark was introduced and then we quickly realized that it was maybe just a little too much equipment for your average apartment building. So I went back to the drawing board and invented the piranha, which is a much simpler, easy version of shark. The wastewater in the facility comes down the main sewer line where all the suites discharge all of their wastewater and we go into a holding tank. From that holding tank, we have one supply pump that feeds into the piranha at a set interval. Once the piranha has all the fluid in it it needs to operate, the heat pump technology kicks in to extract the energy out of that wastewater. And then on the discharge side of the heat pump, we supply the building with the heated water where we use the wastewater as its heat source. The wastewater and the domestic hot drinking water are kept entirely separate. The wastewater is essentially just cooled and had the energy extracted from it and continues down the drain as if it always was. The beauty of that is you get to use the same energy every day in perpetuity. The Piranha and the Piranha HCs comes in various different sizes, so we've developed a simple little calculator that'll determine the size for your building. So this particular building, 60 units, required a T10 unit, but if you've got a thousand units, you might need two T15s. So they come in three different sizes, T5, T10, and T15, and they make varying uh, quantities of hot water. We're saving CO2, but we're also reducing the thermal heat that's discharged every day in the world. So what the Piranha does for any building in the world is reduce your carbon footprint, reduces your energy cost, and provides energy certainty for the future.